All right, we have a live look at Progressive Field where the Guardians will host the Yankees tomorrow in Game 3 of the American League Division Series. You know they're playing right now, and I mm -hmm. think they're still up 3-2, right? 4-2. 4-2. Hey, now, hey, now. Now, Cleveland baseball fans no doubt remember this scene from 15 years ago. Now, during game two of the division series against the Yankees, a swarm of midges just wouldn't leave New York pitcher Jabba Chamberlain alone. Chamberlain threw a wild pitch, allowing Cleveland to tie the game, which they eventually won in extra innings. Now, this sign inside the Renaissance Hotel reminds people to close their windows during midseason. It's also a reminder of what happened during that game. So, can we expect to see a similar scene this weekend when the Yankees come to town again? Our Katie McGraw spoke with the Ohio DNR about the possibility of a midge invasion. Please say we can't have this again, right, Katie? <laughs> it is unlikely. It's a big question, Courtney, about tomorrow's Guardian games. Will there be another swarm like in 2007 or even last weekend at the Browns game? First things first, a big hatch that typically happens in the fall and in the spring. For the fall batch, it would be in early October. And they're like it when the temperatures are around the 70s and nights in the fall. But the, the, the real answer to that question is going to be it, it depends on the weather conditions. Uh, and these midges have a hard time flying when the temperatures are in the 50s. So again, that means it's pretty unlikely for another huge swarm of midges because a cold front's moving through our area tonight and early tomorrow. It's going to bring a few showers to the area tonight, early tomorrow with breezy winds and keeping our temperatures locked in the 50s. So you just heard him say it, so it is unlikely. Could there be a couple? Absolutely. We're going to talk a little bit more about that cold front coming up. Man, you scared us, Katie. I'm glad to hear that, though. <laughs> we'll talk to you soon.